Hello Vikings and welcome back to another awesome Creed Valhalla video. So, I can say that Beast did leave this comment in one of my videos and I actually thought this is really great idea to make a video about. So, the question is, can you save in Niflheim aka the Forgotten Saga DLC? Well, the answer is yes and no. So, you cannot do a quick save or manual save, but the game, it will actually save while you are in Niflheim. So, if you need to break, if your game crashes or you just had to stop for some reason or another, yes, you will be launched back into the Niflheim. So as you can see, I cannot load, I cannot save, but what we can do, we can quit to the title screen, aka closing the game. So let's see what is gonna happen when all of this rolls out. Here we go into the loading screen. After this, we are gonna be into the title screen. So let's see what is gonna happen, what the continuation button will say. That and much more coming really, really soon. And around the time you are watching this video, or around the time this video is uploaded, I will be live streaming Redux Reset for this week. Join us in the live stream, say hello in the chat if you want. If you don't, that's okay, but let's see, let's try to continue the game and exploration, Niflheim, here we go. But moment of truth, so we need to get out of the loading screens, I will speed up this process a little bit. So here we go, drum roll, well not really, but still, we have Almost exactly the same health, I don't know, uh, we did lose two health for some reason. But all of the runes, all of the weapons, all of the gear, it is exactly the same, in exactly the same order. So yeah, there we go. So basically, and basically not, you can and can't save in Niflheim DLC. But if you need to take a break, had to stop your gaming session for some reason or another, you will be fine. There is also two other things I want to speak about. The other one, it is not Niflheim related and the other one is. But let's go over what's not. So, in Don Ragnarok DLC, in Karas Domain, in Valkyrie Arena basically. In past week or so, I have had more of this than not. So when we are starting the challenge, any challenge, doesn't matter. At least for me, like 8 times out of 10. I can actually use infinite powers in the arena. Even sometimes this is applying to the other gameplay in Dawn of Ragnarok. So has this happened to you? Have you played the Dawn of Ragnarok and have you played the Forgotten Saga DLC? But yeah, infinite Odin powers, that's awesome. And moving on to the last thing, so this was actually pretty new to me. I don't think I have ever seen Hervor, aka the wholesome warrior, acting this way. This time she was captured in Jotun camp. After freeing her, we actually did receive 90 coins. And yeah, usually she is asking held arrows or something. I don't think I have ever encountered her without asking any of those for her blade, basically. This time it was simple freeing mission, well, we did speak to her, after that she will fight with you, but note, she can actually die. So, my question to you guys about this, where you have encountered her, and have you completed the side mission The Wholesome Warrior, aka part of the Freedom Fighter trophy, where you can actually get permanent favors and summoned courage, for that mission, it is really, really awesome. So, back to the question. Have you encountered Hervor? If so, 
where, which areas, because I have encountered her in Karlstad, in Duggerland, and also in Nidheim, but never seen her in Helheim. But I will keep trying, I will keep you updated. Also, if you want to keep me updated about your encounters, you can join my Discord, where you can share screenshots, small video clips, if you want. And one last question, how you would actually rate the Niflheim DLC from scale 1 to 10, because this DLC is getting solid 9 out of 10 from me. I mean, it was pretty repeatable and replayable. Only complaint from me, it is actually the fact it actually could have been longer. Because I really enjoyed playing this, I still play this. So let me know your comments, your thoughts in the comment section down below. I'm really keen to hear what you have to say about this DLC. And yeah, in my opinion, the best thing about this DLC was the fact this is completely free. Only thing you need to do it is just playing the game, advance a little bit in the game. Of course, have your game updated so you can play this. And by the way, if you are playing on Xbox, are you still having troubles with the Secret Plot Festival? Let me know that and much more in the comments down below. But for now, before rolling the outro, I want to thank my channel members, aka the Elite Wolfpack. You guys are awesome. But until the next time. Nidhogg feasts on pain and death. Sate him with this mortal flesh. Thanks for watching. Remember to hit the like, hit the sub, turn on the notifications so you won't ever miss anything that I upload or when I go live. Also Vikings, have fun, stay safe, be strong. Hope to see you in the next one. Skatha, over and up, and bye bye.